guys, welcome to Bastion Time. I'm your host, Bastion. Let's get to some Zelda news, shall we? First of all, there was that big box set of uh, strategy guides that Prima released that was pretty fancy, and inside was a certificate of authentication, as well as a statement from Mr. Ichigenuma, of course, the Zelda producer. He thanked fans for um, all of their dedication to the series, and then he said, uh, my desire is to create a unique experience that is beyond your expectations. And, um, well, yeah, what else is he going to say? <laughs> He's not going to say, I desire to create a game that's below your expectations, you know. I don't know. But, you know, at least it's an interesting quote that shows that he plans on trying to, you know, make a really great Zelda game. But, of course, that's what he's going to do, right? If you still haven't picked up A Link Between Worlds, it's now on sale at uh, Amazon and Walmart on their online website shops. Um, it's not a dramatic price cut, but it's less than its normal price, so if you want to pick that up, there's a link for you down below. And speaking of A Link Between Worlds, it is Game Informer's Game of the Month, so that's pretty cool. I mean, it really is an amazing game. Might be my favorite Zelda game of all time, I don't know, I just finished playing it twice back to back. So I'm still in that honeymoon phase of, uh, wow, I just really love this game. Uh, maybe in a month or two I might come to my senses and realize that it's only my second or third favorite Zelda game, but we shall see. Anyways, that's it for this episode of Zelda News, see you guys tomorrow for some Nintendo news, bye guys.